Just a big giant ketchup packet. Here, sir, here's your ketchup packet. Instead, they give you these little rinky dink little pitch packets. Beating time! Yo, welcome to Feeding Time, Rybackers. Big guy Ryback, back once again, and uh, came back to the Garden Grill here today. I just had my coffee, so I'm all freaking jacked and jacked on that that black cocaine from Starbucks. And uh, I came here, they have a crispy chicken sandwich with bacon and sweet potato fries. And I love this place. They, they just hooked me up here. I think we're a lot of people. If you guys are in Vegas, come check them out. You guys get me free meals. So, and again, that can't go in any bearing of the review process. It just, they tend to, they'll have, their, their stuff is, is at the top of the list on the rankings. And uh, I still think their chicken fingers too. Their buffalo fingers are the best I've ever had. And uh, texture everything. And I need to try them with ranch eventually. But today, I got their crispy chicken sandwich, sweet potato fries. Here it has the, the vegan. All oh, this is vegan, guys. Bacon. We got the bread. We got the, the vegan chipotle sauce. We got lettuce and tomato underneath on that. So, uh, sorry. I'm in a spot where there's a lot of people. I've had a lot going on, guys. Got my napkins here. Thank goodness. And uh, I'm, we're uh, going to be selling my house if I can, uh, and, uh, it's gone up a lot in value and, uh, I want to move to a closer part of Vegas. I've talked about, I found a place it's, it's being built right now. That's bigger than my place and I think bigger backyard, everything, um, four garages, four bay garage for the gym to be a whole, whole section bigger, which is what I've always wanted. And the reason I didn't get into my house is because I got, and this has a bigger Gen X suite, which is the mother-in-law suite with the kitchen, washer dryer, everything. That's even bigger on, and on this side of the house. But I, on the house that I got, it was, I lost one section of the garage for the living room of the uh, casita. And, oh God, this guy's pulling up next to me. Okay. He left. Anyways, let's get on to the feed the food down to do let's get the setting just right the mood i got my matcha green tea just i like, put it in a big jug take a little sip of this i gotta run to lowe's gotta get something over there and then i gotta i gotta go do a big back workout at home so ah that's oh, whoa this is gonna blow my ball oh my goodness you guys look how good this looks Jesus. <laughs> mm. Wow. It has like bacon. How do they do this? That looks like chicken. I have to be extra careful. I tend to make a mess whenever I eat at Garden Grill. Whether it's the beetroot spilling something on me. Not today. Today is going to be a clean video. Wow. My balls have been blown off. Oh. I look forward to this. These these I've never had one thing here that's even remotely bad.
I'm trying because I'm moving. The, if I get this place that I want, which I'll find out more here in the upcoming weeks or even days, I'm going to be living in a central location in Vegas, a lot busier than where my section's super busy where I'm at now, but I'll be a lot closer to everything. But it's a very high walls on the property. It's very tucked away. Like I've, uh, so there's a lot of, lot of positives. I'm trying to convince myself that I love being around people, like large groups of people, which I don't, but I'm telling myself that I'm trying to trick myself. This is so damn good. Big thank you guys on everybody supporting me on TikTok, man. That the count is on fire. I've been trying to get a hold of someone from Twitter. I've messaged them for four and a half years, by the way. There came a point, I remember when I was really injured, I was just like, what am I gonna do? No one's responding. And I didn't make a big deal of it until I got more information. And I realized I go, the only way I'm gonna get this fixed is being very vocal about it and getting them to eventually, they literally have not responded to a DM. I mean, there's DMs, everything, them not responding to four and a half years. You have to ask yourself, why is that? It's crazy. And we look my, so out of my 1,400 and it's like 1.45, just under 1.5 million, which hasn't gone up in four and a half years either, right? It's just been frozen. But everywhere else has grown. So you ask yourself, How's that even possible? I don't know. But they don't respond. They don't communicate. And we are looking at the analytics. On the majority of my tweets, far less than 1% of my following even see them. So that means there's a small percentage of under 1% typically. Say 1% of that is even seeing my post. That's far off. And it, it's, it's, a, it's actually, that's if, if 1% is if a, a tweet does good for considering how bad it's been. So, really, really uh, frustrating to be uh, handcuffed like that. And I told you, I know what's going on. So, Eventually, we're going to get the right person that can get me hooked up with somebody that, that's high up there that can just release my account and get it, and that's all it's going to take. That's what happened on TikTok, and that's why that's blowing up now. Also, we got this fixed. I pretty much did two months of, of literally two months straight of YouTube videos. Not No ads. And by that, YouTube switched the programming. And it's something, it shut them all off that we've had. And it dated back for two months. I had to go back and manually turn them on for two months worth of videos. And I just, now I have to check every video to double check to make sure that they doesn't get shut off. And why they got shut off, I don't know. But I knew something was up because I told you guys the ad revenue just crashed and all the videos were, I was like, what's going on? Contacted them and they looked into it and then they couldn't answer that question. And uh, yeah, so it's pretty frustrating, but I have fun doing this, so whatever. But give me problems and I'll give you solutions.
I keep working regardless. Keep working regardless. That's where I don't stop. I just keep doing the work. These sweet potato fries are damn good. Get a little ketchup on these bad boys. I'm going to try to get all this ketchup in here. Man, I wish ketchup packets were easier. They give you such a small amount in each packet. Like, can't they make these like 10 times the size? I've never seen anyone that just needs one ketchup packet. Just make them big. That's what she said. Just a big, giant ketchup packet. Here, sir, here's your ketchup packet. Instead, they give you these little rinky-dink little pitch packets. This orthodontics place really screws with me right here by the garden grill. It's called Wyatt Orthodontics. And I just picture Bray being the lead the lead dentist in there. And it cracks me up. I, 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 that's how Ryback Psychology, every time I see it, I picture Bray like in a little coat with the goggles. He's, he's working there when he's not wrestling on Raw during the week because they're down to one day, so it's his part-time job. And that's his full-time job. Wrestling is his part-time job. Walking around with his little fiend mask. <laughs> uh, he's a good guy. I like him a lot. I like everybody. Somebody actually just said, they're like, is there anybody that you actually like in, in WWE? I was like, I like everybody. Like, why would you think I don't like everybody? I'm like, what What are you reading? What I don't, I don't even know half the time what the people are even reading. To, where it's like either they love me or they massively hate me. Did a and a with someone. They asked about Paul Heyman. And I just said he was a piece of shit during our time. And that doesn't mean I've talked real, multiple times. Like, oh, I respect Paul still. I like Paul. I can get along with I've had conversations with him after our thing. I was like, but I, what it was. And that I answered a question. But people just can't like. They just can't comprehend, especially like the, that disease, mentally ill, negative wrestling mark mind. Like, it, they're mad. Long gone. And then whatever their opinion is, they will seek out to confirm that opinion relentlessly. They'll even take things out of context to confirm their opinion. On their own, they change it to match what they want to think. I'm just like, man, I'm sorry uh, it, you want to be miserable. Just mind your own business, man. If you don't like something, don't just go. But yet they keep finding me. It's like the people on here too with the videos. When I, someone gets really triggered at me, they'll leave like 10 comments in a row. I'm assuming on multiple videos. I'll read one sentence and then just see they had leave a bunch and I just mute them. Never see any of it. So it's just wasted typing. <laughs> but everything's so loving otherwise and positive. It's like, why do you have to? Come on now. It's good, though. They give me content to talk about on here. Can't just be talking about love and positivity all the time. Nobody will watch. Damn, they're going to a lot of sweet potato fries. Trying to get me fat? This was just under 14 bucks. 13 and change. And I'll say, well worth it. I think the sweet potato fries was an upgrade, if I'm not mistaken. Maybe it wasn't. Well, in all seriousness, I didn't even pay for this. They gave it to me for free. But it was 14. Mmm. Get ready to go to Columbia. Go get those stem cells. I gotta give myself a little time to, to rest. Let the stem cells do their work their magic, which they work for like six months, just really hardcore. But what I'll be doing is probably take a, a week or two off just to let my body rest. And then the training will resume, take it by, day by day, see how I'm feeling, week by week, get this move all out of, taken out of the way, and then uh, I'll be close to where the wrestling ring is here. In my new place, I think, I got to see the yard, 
But if the yard's big enough, I'll just buy the ring because of my HOA, I wasn't allowed to do it at my house <clears throat> that I have. And I, I would have, it would have been a tight fit on the space that I had. So if I got more space, I'll just get my own ring. I'm not, I just, I need to know that though. Prior, I got to see the lot size and the land layout. Then I'd have to do my, build a new pool and all that. Well, that's going to take time. But anyways, I can get the ring if I can out there. We'll time out. We'll see. If not, the wrestling school's not far away from where I'll be. Not horribly far anyway. So done. Give me a second here. I got to empty this loser food tray. Let's see what it does. It's amazing. I used to be so embarrassed about that. Now I don't even give a damn. All right. <clears throat> that was the Garden Grill off of Buffalo and uh, Lake Mead. <sighs> They're crispy chicken sandwich with bacon and sweet potato fries. I'm giving that 9.4 out of 10. Absolutely delicious. I like, I've had their buffalo chicken or their Nashville hot. I don't know if I've had the buffalo. I've had the buffalo fingers, but I love buffalo sauce. If that was a buffalo sauce, which I should get that with the bacon and try that, that I have a feeling is going to be like a 9.8 or 9. Um, but 9.4 for that. That was delicious. The texture, very crispy. The chicken, the vegan chicken, actually very like chicken like um i think you could fool a lot of people with that and guys yeah this is processed food guys it's processed with plants though it's so it's like it, it, it's a good processed and um also educate yourselves too on soy uh meat industries put out a lot of false information on soy it's a complete protein and it will not raise your estrogen it is actually all bs and uh <clears throat> We've been fed a lot of lies, guys. So we have to educate ourselves on food. And the best thing to do is to try it for ourselves over a period of time. Always get lab work and always go by how you feel. And that will, don't, we live in a world where we are being lied to left and right. And not to say there are truth, there are truths out there. There are good companies, but there's more bad. And we have to ask questions and we have to, and we have to do our homework on things. And like, I could tell you, I have no agenda. I'm not getting anything from, from any of this, from, you know what I'm saying? I'm just, this is all stuff of research I've done and you need to, you know, do the same if you choose to go down this route, but fix our food. We fix our mood guys. It's the, it's the one thing. And, uh, we got We got to take control. We got to take control now. And, uh, because damn it, we deserve the best and we're going to get it. So anyways, right backers, thank you very much as always for watching. And uh, I'll see you on, see you around, see you around town, Charlie Brown. Feed me more. Thank you guys very much for watching this Feed Me More TV episode. To check out my podcast, The Ryback Show and the Shooting Blanks Wrestling Report, please support us over at Patreon, patreon.com backslash Ryback. We have two different tiers available over there for both those shows. Feed Me More Nutrition available on feedmemore.com and Amazon. All first-time buyers can save 25% on the website with discount code SAVE25. And for all personal videos from yours truly, cameo.com backslash the big guy Ryback. Thank you guys again. Love you very much. Get hungry, stay hungry, be more. Feed me more.